Hey guys, and welcome to my channel, Dave K Travels. I am David, and here I want to share with you everything I learned about travel and photography. Today, I'm actually doing my very first unboxing video on YouTube for you guys. I will show you a very cool product that I've come across on Kickstarter last summer. It's the Travel Tripod by Peak Design. Maybe some of you already heard about that company. They're based in San Francisco and invented those very cool handy quick release camera strips which some of you are using. It took almost six long months until Peak Design finally reached out and notified me about the arriving shipment. But I think it was worth it. So here it is, the all new travel tripod by Peak Design. I already had to get rid of the cardboard because it simply was too big to transport. But it's still wrapped up in plastic. So let's get it out of here. setting fine sound is awesome. So here it is guys. Fresh out of the box. So let's get into it. All right, so before opening the box, I would say let's just have a quick look on each of the sides. Here it says travel tripod, compact ball head, five segments, 150 centimeter maximum height and aluminum alloy. There are two options available for the travel tripod on the website of Peak Design. You can get them either in aluminum alloy, like this one here on my table, or in carbon fiber. The difference between these two versions are mainly the weight and obviously the price tag for which Peak Design is selling them. On this side we have three pictures of the travel tripod in different sceneries and on the last page we have some specific information about the tripod. For example, the weight it's 1.56 kg or 3.44 pounds. Um, if collapsed, it has a height of 39.4 centimeters or 15.5 inches. The diameter is 7.9 centimeters or 3.1 inches. And it can take a maximum load of incredible 9.1 kilograms, which is 20 pounds. So you can even use the travel tripod with your biggest lenses. And we have their uh, smartphone symbol too, so there will be a smartphone mount in there as well. And I almost forgot to mention, it's climate neutral certified. So very cool of you, Peak Design. Now let's have a look into the box. Nice, nice rubber bands here on both sides, by the way. Never have seen that before. Oh wow, that's a really sleek bag. Let's put this here aside. So what we've got here, two Peak Design stickers. Nice. And this very cool looking grayish bag here for the tripod. You can obviously feel it already in it. It even seems that it's water resistant because of its texture. Texture on the super here let's get it out oh 
Oh, nice. Nice. <coughs> Look at that. Look at that profile. It's so incredible thin compared to other tripods. Just awesome. And it's even smaller than I expected it to be. And lighter. They really managed to minimize the lost space in the center of the tripod as much as possible so it can get as thin as possible almost no space here awesome the trapper is very compact and the legs feel very sturdy already Let's put it here. Okay, here we've got a little booklet. It's useful information about the tripod. You can see all the parts of it. And here it says phone mount. We'll come to that later. plate and some instruction how to handle it. All right, let's put that aside as well. <clears throat> so, okay. This little deployable knob, ah, okay, it's, a, it's magnetic. With that you can adjust the height of the ball head. Mm -hmm. That's very smooth. And I, I really like the sound and feel of that knob. <laughs> okay. And on the top of the ball head, we have the this adjustment ring. To tilt the ball head in every direction, even 90 degrees for vertical shots like this. That's cool. But I think this is a basic feature of a tripod. The only downside I see here with this ball head is that the tripod, if you want to get some panning moves, you won't really get them without unintentionally tilting the camera because there's always a little bit movement in any direction but yeah that's the only downside I see here let's put that down again here okay then next there's a flip locking mechanism on each of the legs here for low ground shots so now you cannot move it anymore, any further legs, but if you put this lever down, like this you can extend even further the legs. So get those nice, really cool looking ground shots can do this with every leg and what else 
even can get some cool ground shots by taking the center column completely out of here. But before we have to remove the hook. And insert it the other way around. Like this. Just a knob here. Now we have the ball head on the bottom for cool shots near over the ground. Um, then there we have the hook that we already had to pull out for the inverted shot. Under the hook there's the before mentioned foam mount that's really cool i think you just can put it on the plate on the top let's just change Back to the original state. So, if we remove the standard big design plate here, we can just put the foam mount in it. There we have it. And then you can just put your foam in there. Nice. Really, really nice. The Peak Design Plate, by the way, also works with the clip that you can buy separately. I often use it when I go traveling on my belt or on my backpack straps. That's really cool because it's a very easy and quick way to secure your camera on the go. What I really like about it, everything is magnetic, so it stays in place. It's a very neat little feature. The hook on the bottom here is for counterweight, by the way. So, for example, if you have your backpack on your shoulders, you want to rest a little bit, just can hang it in there and the tripod gets even more stabilized. <clears throat> there is a 2.5 millimeters and 4 millimeter hex tool here on one of the legs for all bolts that they are that are used here for this tripod that's really nice that they supported it and i think i felt one more maintenance tool here in this hidden sleeve in the back of the tripod ah yeah that's it for more detailed videos, you can visit the Peak Design website, how to use them correctly on the tripod for maintenance.
I have to say that this tripod has a very thoughtful design, all in all. It's, that's really nice. So, you can extend the legs all by one move with one hand here. This comes in very handy. So, in my opinion, it's a very cool design and awesome tripod for your travels. It doesn't weigh much, it's not very big, but it has every feature that a tripod should have. Well, that's it. That's new travel tripod by Peak Design. Thank you for watching guys. If you like it, I would appreciate a like or comment on the video. And if you want to see more unboxing or review videos, just let me know. By the way, I have an Instagram account as well. It's Dave K Photography. Check it out. Thanks. Peace out.